Hey guys, it's Amtrak and Oscale, and I just wanted to do an update here on uh, where things are at with the channel. Just let you know what I'm doing and stuff, you know. Uh, so yeah, um, I am. I'm getting some more stuff in. I'm starting to get back in the swing of things. So yeah, uh, this is a Santa Fe Golden Gate Depot 18 inch baggage. I just ordered that, and uh, I'm gonna have that hopefully repainted into phase six what some of you might call phase 4b um, the official name is phase six from amtrak if you want to look that up go ahead it's on amtrak's website and wikipedia but i'm not gonna i don't want to get any arg into any arguments in the comments you can you guys can do your own research anyway yeah this is a uh, 18 inch aluminum car um, it's got full detail and stuff like that. The doors open, yada, yada, yada. I'm gonna have that repainted by Christine Braden, who is the same artist that did my Phase 4 Heritage unit, which I have sold to a happy guy in, uh, Missouri, because I'm trying to fund my addiction again. <laughs> um, but yeah, I did add another, I did add another, uh, Horizon coach to my fleet. So if I move this out of the way here That is a really sweet baggage car by the way. So now I'm up to five cars I did just add this uh, this coach right here. And I'm working on as you see here I'm working on getting details into these two coaches so I can send them send them off to re uh, be repainted they they came to me undecorated and uh, like really undecorated there was nothing in there but yeah i'm gonna have those uh painted up in uh, phase six as well and um other news i did just uh snag a um super liner no not a suit as a surf liner it's k-line surf liner coach off of ebay the 21 inch one so i'm very pleased with that and um I other stuff that I have uh I I have coming in eventually. I did order a Golden Gate Depot brass superdome, um the 1950s version. I had that. I I ordered that as a private car cuz you know that that ran on Amtrak uh, Amtrak trains quite often. But yeah, I I guess I I got kind of good fleet here. I also ordered uh, three, if I didn't say it already, I ordered three AM fleets um, from Golden Gate Depot, and I did order a baggage as well, a Viewliner baggage, so I'm very happy about that. Gonna get some nice 21-inch cars in here soon, and I'll let you know when that brass uh, dome comes in, but yeah, I actually have a really cool uh, organization system here now. I got cabinets and stuff. It's a lot different from when you last saw it. I just had crap on a table, but yeah, we kind of, my mom and I kind of cleaned this space out, so I just have a space to put all my stuff in there. I'm down to just two P42s and a Dash 8, but that's okay. Um, I might try and get rid of the P4, one of the P42s, the uh, Phase 5. I'm going to try and sell that, so... Um, I'll let you know when that's for sale. It's not for sale just yet, because I have somebody that I want to sell it to, and if he doesn't want it right away, then uh, like, af uh, like after uh, I give him some time to, to save up for it, because that's what he's doing, um, if he doesn't want it then, then I'll put it up for sale, and you guys can fight for it in the comments. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's kind of where we're at right now. Um, I might order a couple of P42s, we'll see. I've spent a lot right now, uh, and that's, you know, for an 18, 18 year old kid that's a college student, this is a lot. <laughs> this is quite a bit. I mean, the brass dome alone was 700, and, you know, which is, oh, which is stupid money, but if you really think about it, I think eventually it'll be worth more than that because it's brass. I mean, you know, there's a lot of people saying brass doesn't hold its value anymore, which is kind of true, but I think that the brass dome I got might hold some value because, the you know, it's Golden Gate Depot and it's a, such a nice car. I mean, really, the super domes are just gorgeous. If any if there's anything to go off of uh, on their 
great domes that they made, the GN great domes, those were, and the Santa Fe, um, uh, I don't, I don't know if they were, they were great domes, but I know Bud did make like, like Santa Fe dome, full domes and stuff like that. But yeah, um, that's kind of where we're at. And, uh, I'm hoping to have some nice stuff for you soon. And I'll let you know when, uh, you'll be, you guys will be the first to see the, uh, the Golden Gate Dome. I'll just unbox it here on the channel and that'll be pretty cool. Anyway, that's it for, that's it for today. And I hope you guys enjoy this little update and I hope y'all are look for, looking forward to all the new stuff I got coming in. I am really looking forward to it, but yeah, that's it. And I will see you in the next one.